<laughs> he was not kind to the Utes and Cougars, but one team is celebrating a big win. How about those Utah State Aggies? They win on the road. They beat the previously undefeated San Diego State Aztecs in a pretty well-rounded effort. Yeah, absolutely. Jordan Love didn't throw a touchdown pass, but he was efficient. 30 of 47 for 293 yards, no interceptions, a 63.8% completion rate, his longest pass, a 48-yard connection with Savon Scarver that set up a Jalen Warren touchdown. He also connected with former Ute COC Mariner seven times for 74 yards. The Aggies are sixth in the nation in total offense. Been racking it up, and running back Jalen Warren's been a part of that. Continues to be a great addition to this Aggies offense as you go transfer carry the 17 times for 74 yards. One of those carries was an 11 yard touchdown run just before the half for a 20 to 3 lead. He also had three receptions for 40 more yards. East High represent the Aggie defense with the exception of two fourth down plays was phenomenal. They held a team known for their run game to just two yards per carry. Ten tackles for loss, four sacks, and a defensive touchdown from Bond. Shaq Bond. A 48 yard pick six. The Aggies first score of the game. It was a wild fourth quarter in that one too. The Aggies led by 20, but thanks to a couple of near miraculous touchdowns on fourth down by San Diego State, they were able to close the gap to six points late in this game. The Aggie defense, they were able to hold though, and San Diego State quarterback Ryan Agnew had nowhere to go but back. Trying to keep the play alive, he ran all the way back down to nearly his own goal line. He was called for intentional grounding. Aggies take over. It's their first win over San Diego State since 1967.